okay guys 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 um yeah so uh the mountain update is up <laughs> is out uh yeah it's at least the preview it's the 3.2 instead of 4.0 version but it's it's the preview so the thing with this preview is and i'll include instructions in the description on how you can get it because you have to do something special to be able to get it you have to uh, change settings because it's a potentially buggy preview so but the thing with that is um yeah, the mountain biome is up, so it's out, and you guys have already been coming to me going, Jay, Jay, the update's out, the update's out, so I thought we might as well just jump in and try it, so the thing is, I'm gonna probably put up a poll, depending on how this goes, on whether or not you want to switch back and forth with a, the new tribe that will be starting here, or whether you want to try something totally different, or what do you guys want to do if you just want to continue with the new tribe and leave the old jungle update one behind, or what you guys want to do, so, but for now, I figured you might want, like, to, uh, get started and see what's going on, so we're gonna go ahead, but first let me go over so uh there's a lot of new features so it says two new islands snow and grass island in the snow islands some islands reworked as well a new biome mountain along with two new predators and one new prey type i'm super excited for that and i'm really really hoping the new predator may be a wolf-like predator i've been hoping they'll do something like that for a long time or one of them at least there's two apparently but I'm, i've been hoping like for a pack predator for a long time because so far the only creature that we know lives in packs in this is the the tribelings the niche tribelings that we have and it'd be so cool to have a predator that works in packs but we'll see we'll see what they've done yeah, I am very, very curious. Uh, twin birth and fertility system. That seems really, really interesting. Um, updated sickness mechanics. Sickness can now spread. So it's going to be important to isolate creatures that are sick, I think. New prehistoric genes. They've been talking about this for forever, and I had no idea it was coming in this update. Temperature system that allows more flexible weather and temperature events. Added heat and cold resistance. Added filters to family tree. Lots of big and small bug fixes and improvements, and lots of new bugs. So it could be a buggy version. We might run into uh, game stopping bugs and you guys the music is new the music has changed it's different now oh man I am so excited and I will say okay so I have very little experience with this I did try playing it before and uh, things went poorly and didn't work out right from the very beginning I couldn't even find I couldn't find the island so uh, I decided to just start over with a new tribe <laughs> and uh, hopefully we'll find it now because I have a feeling the island the I'll, I'll show you what I mean so we're going to start a new game, and we're going to call it uh, J Plays 3.2. We're going to hit play. Uh, but yeah, I couldn't figure out what was going on with the... Um, here, I'll show you. The island port colors have changed, and I couldn't figure out what the heck was going on with that. So, um, and we'll meet our creatures and sex. So here's the flower island. Oh yeah, and everything looks totally different. You guys, look how different this looks. The grass has changed. I and look at the you the rocks have changed but yeah so this is the new update we got a really small island which is good so this is a uh, killer island I did not realize that was going to be a thing and uh, it has changed and these blurred together that's maybe not such a good thing but um this is the killer island and uh, I did not know that I thought it might be the mountain because the colors have changed but no it's a killer island a less hard one this of course is the jungle you can see the leaf clutter from the jungle on the ground so we're probably gonna just scoot ourselves right off to the um, uh, right off to the uh, the flower island first and hopefully there will be a port to the mountains I'm hoping we'll know it when we see it because it's not the most intuitive thing in the world so but yeah so there's a lot of new things so we recognize most of these genes hearing smelling sight stealth scentless but there's now cold resistance and heat resistance and we now have fertility and um, immunity to sickness so uh, you, you can see a lot of these new genes are here we have the horns ears nose slash head the body the nimble fingers and claws of so the paws the the uh, hind legs eyes tail tail the medium tail I think does something now as I think it actually gives cold resistance yet yeah, medium tail gives cold resistance color re uh, main color pattern all these things are the same and then the immunity genes are here it's gonna be more important to keep your animals from getting sick now and then fertility so let's see hopefully it'll work yeah okay um so yeah see it did not work uh it actually we have to try again so breeding is not a guaranteed anymore there we go that time it worked so i'm going to go ahead we'll have them have a few babies uh, we'll start a new day and we'll see so let's see how did this guy do he got he can't eat okay 
Um, oh, okay. So he doesn't get any when he's a baby. They don't, they don't get any of that. But so he got... Do they both have... Yeah, they both have short-sighted eyes. So he did get the short-sighted eyes, which is not a good thing. Uh, but he got a lot of other okay genetics. And then I'm actually going to... We'll gather. We'll go this way. And then... Let's see. Yep, it worked. And then we can put a nest here. We're going to just start moving this way and try to go to the flower island. And I'm hoping the fact that these ports blend together won't screw anything up. So we're going to start a new day. We got some new genes unlocked. Start a new day. Had another baby, another male, who has short-sighted eyes. He got blue eyes, which is cool, but they're sh he's short-sighted. So I'm going to put him on Omega. And uh, we'll move baby this way. So I'm going to put this guy on Omega because we don't want to use him for breeding him. Well, he doesn't have anything to mark with orange just yet, but I'm actually going to come here, gather, and then come up. Oh, apparently we can't do that, but we can gather from here next time. And we're going to just start making our way down to these ports and we're going to breed him again. But, um, okay. So let's see. So I'm actually going to gather with this guy and then we'll come over here, breed. Did it work? It worked. And then we'll move the baby here, and then we'll use this nest, and then I'm actually going to start clearing a path for them to get to the ports. So we'll start a new day again. I want to get a female that has good immunity. Got another male. Dang it. And... Okay, he's okay genetically. And let's make sure I'm actually going to bring her over here. We'll breed them. Did it, it, nope, it didn't work, so we have to try again. So it's no longer a guaranteed, oh, are you serious? Yeah, it did not work. Some, it's a little glitchy in the notifications. There we go. So we'll come back over here, and we'll continue to gather, and we'll gather from here as well. Keep getting claw creatures. It would be nice to get some nimble fingers in there. But I want to make sure we gather everything. We'll have the chance. Oh, and we have a female, so okay. Uh, B and F. A and F. B and F. Okay, so I want to try and get another male B and G. Are you serious? No, you don't even have... Okay. It makes me feel a little bit better. And we're actually going to destroy this nest. But we do have a female that we could breed if we need to. And then I'm going to move this baby this way. Oh, 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 who's this? Who's this? Isra. Isra. Okay, Isra has new genes. So let's look at her genes. So she has hemophilia, which is bad. She has totally new immunity, which would be good. I think neither of them have... Yep, neither of them have that. She has very bad fertility, though. And she has blind eyes. I'm going to invite her into the tribe, and we'll see what happens. So she has a no paw and a runner's leg, and we're just going to see how this goes. Because uh, there's no harm in trying, right? So possibly we could breed her with one of the descendants of Adam and Eve. And I'm going to actually get Adam on the port over here. And uh, let's see. But I suspect we might have a bit of a time of things. And I'm actually going to leave Kyrkirvan here. So we're going to leave him to gather from these plants. And I'm actually going to... Oh, we can't destroy... We'll keep gathering and then we'll move this way. And we're going to move Ismay here. And we're going to move... Kuvan this way. I want to get them on the ports before they get too old or anything like that. And we're going to stick to these ports because they kind of blend it all together. And then Eve is going to come this way. And we'll start one more new day. And then you are the one who's staying, right? Okay. Gather, gather, gather. And uh, I'm going to destroy this and then come this way with uh, Isme. And then we'll come this way, come this way, and then we'll come back this way. And then Kirkirvan is going to destroy this plant as well. So we have lots more food. And then we're actually going to move Eve over this way. And we'll start, we'll travel, and hopefully it doesn't break it because the ports are blending together. Hopefully. Are we good? Are we good? I'm hoping we're good. Um, I hope so. And we're probably going to have a very nomadic... Yes, it worked! We're going to probably have a very nomadic tribe for a bit here. So that's jungle. This... I don't know if that would be mountain or not. I'm going to go to maybe... Maybe we'll try it. Maybe we'll try it. I think the mountain ones are blue. So do we smell anything? We I smell digger paw things, but none of us have digger paw. That's, that's fine. 
All right, it's a little bit laggy because it's a, a new and large island and we'll probably try and breed some of our creatures a little bit here. And let's come up this way. Got to look for food and a food we can actually collect at that. I don't smell any berry bushes. And we'll start a new day because we can't do anything else. I'm going to try and get to that. Uh, oh my. I'm going to try and get to that new island though. And we really need to find food this turn because... Oh, there's a berry bush. Okay, quickly move towards it. And I'm actually going to put Kuvan here. And Kuvan can kill this mole. And then we'll have Eve. I wanna, I'm want i going to breed them again soon as well because I don't want them to uh, pass away without having passed on that nimble fingers because that helps a lot and in the meantime we're going to keep making our way we're going to try to go up to this island which i think is a killer island but i'm hoping it'll have portals to the new biome now so we're going to go ahead we'll start a new day and i'm actually great it's going to be drought of course so i'm going to actually move kuvan this way and we'll put you in the nest gather this and then we're going to try and it worked, thankfully. Uh, doesn't always, which is a little bit frustrating sometimes. And we're going to keep moving these guys this way. And keep gathering. Oh, good. We found another berry bush. Okay. That's helpful. <laughs> we'll make sure we start a new day. We had a male who got the claw again. Dang it. And uh, very bad genetics. The short-sighted eyes on double and um b and g so i don't think we're gonna we're, we'll mark him on omega he'll be staying here i'm actually going to move uh eve up here and have her gather because that will help a lot Ooh, and it's a little bit laggy these large islands can lag a lot because they're simulating a lot of things going on in the background so like they they have to simulate for a lot of creatures moving around and things up oh, here is another berry bush which is excellent and then we're going to keep going this way. And then next turn we'll breed them again. Uh, you are on Omega. So Kirito will follow them. Our Kirito will probably stay here. And uh, collect once he is old enough. And so I'm actually going to put Izme up here. And let's have... I'm going to have her Eve gather some. And then, how old are you getting? Isra is getting old, so I want to try breeding Isra to get these immunity genes in, even though we have hemophilia. So do any of the males have hemophilia? Okay, that's easy. me. So none of them do. So who do we want to breed? Yeah, none of them have hemophilia, and none of them have... Oh, oh they do have some similar genetics. So we're going to breed Kuvan and Isra, I think. Actually, I'm going to bring them back here, and I... Uh, um, Isra has the melanism, which I'm thinking will probably not be good in the mountain biome anyway. And I have a feeling... Yep, didn't work. <laughs> I had a feeling because she has a very, very bad fertility. So, let's see. We're going to start this. <gasps> Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. Um... Time to run. Never mind that. Probably a good thing you did not actually manage to have a baby. <laughs> Eve, we're going to move this way. And did you have a... Yes, we got a nimble finger. So Cora, okay. And uh, we're going to move Isra up here. And uh, Kuvan will stay here with her. And these guys can keep it moving. And uh, unfortunately, Cora has short-sighted eyes. You know what? I'm going to put... I haven't actually activated the mutations menu. So we're going to try to mutate this in. And then the other thing I want to mutate, where is it, is the normal hind legs, because we have the uh, swimming hind legs right now. So we're going to keep moving. Eve, we can gather some of these up. Make sure we have enough food. Because we definitely want to make sure we have enough food for everybody. So let's keep moving this way. I don't know if we have to breed Adam and Eve anymore. I'm going to continue. Okay. There we go. I'm actually, I'm going to move uh, Cora up here. And then, yes! Okay, it worked. So I'm going to quickly scoot Kuvan this way. We'll continue to gather. Should have probably, okay. Gather, gather. I don't know. Uh, oh dear. The, uh, the, I think, oh gosh. That might not be good. We might have to bring uh, Kuvan in. Uh, but Kirtaku, I'm going to move up this way because we're going to get everybody on these ports. 
and ready to go so that when the time comes we can move out fairly quickly so I'm going to actually gather and you know what maybe we won't bring these guys because we have a next generation that will work so and then do you have good immunity for being able to breed okay okay similar okay good yes Korra and uh, Kirtaku could breed so that would be good so we'll actually leave these guys here and uh, they can um, stay on this island I'll put them on Omega just so we know and then I have a feeling we may leave Yzerup because she's getting really old and then we want I want to put Korra on Alpha and then Kirta is gonna stay <gasps> oh dear um okay oh we might lose the baby though so <laughs> she's named after her mother though all right let's see um oh and she got the good immunity dang it I want it oh she has bad fertility good eyesight Kirta, I'm going to have gather and then destroy. Uh, we're going to scoot Korra out of here. And then did Kuvan, G and B. G and B. Okay, same immunity. And then, yeah, okay, we're going to have Kuvan attack this carnivore. And then I'm actually going to have how, okay, maybe if Izra attacks. Yes, we did it. Okay, good, 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 good. And then we'll have you um, continue to gather around here. So here we go. We'll leave these guys. Oh, good. We had... Um... Okay, good. Uh, I'm going to put him on Omega. It's raining. That, that's always, that is always a very helpful thing. So I'm actually going to move... Okay, where was... There's another one up there. I'm actually going to have... So we'll have Ezra come this way. We'll have... This Isra can come up here and gather from here, and then we'll gather, gather, and the leg, we'll keep gathering. Is there any, um, yes, you could come up here and gather, because you're not going to be staying. And then we'll make sure we get Korra over here. How are these guys doing on age? They're okay. And then I want to make sure that Isra can make it, so we're going to start a new day. Yet we lost other Isra. So let's, I'm going to bring, oh boy, where was that? It was, let's walk here. And then I'm actually just going to destroy it. And we'll come here and destroy this. Oops. And then I'm going to have Ismate come up. Well, I'll have, maybe I'll have, no, I'll have Adam do it. So that we can light the way. And oh, oh, can she make it? Can she make it? She can't make it this turn. No. Um, not quite this turn. But uh, we'll have to... Oh, and we're going to lose... Kirta staying. Kuvan staying. We're going to lose, though. Oh, boy. I don't want to get down to one male. So we're not going to end up... Okay. We should be okay with immunity genes, even if we do just have Kirtaku. So we're going to keep, I'm actually going to bring Korra up here and have her gather one of these. And then we'll shake the tree again. And then I'm going to start a new day. We're going to try and make our way to that new island. All right, let's get Isra here. Let's get Korra here. Come on, Korra. There we go. And um, we can come back over here, gather these real fast. And is there anything else we can do with these guys? We can have them make their way up here gather and then destroy and then we'll be leaving them and we'll continue on with these guys so we'll have Korra lead the way and I'm trying to get to the mountains you guys I am trying to get to the mountains but it is not working so let's see what um oh 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 oh, oh okay okay this has got to be mountains okay we're gonna get these guys there all right so first of all, though, I want to see if we can breed anyone. So Cora can't move this turn. We have enough food for everyone, thankfully, for a few turns. Let's continue moving everybody this way. If we can find... Oh, we found a berry bush. If we can find any nests, I want to do a little breeding. Uh-oh. Uh, maybe we won't do a little breeding. Okay. Can we get... If 
we move Cora, and I want to move everybody past here as fast as we can. Um, let's move Isra this way. And hopefully the carnivore won't be able to reach her. So I don't think we're going to stop for food. I think we're just going to keep booking it. This has got to be the mountains. Okay. Um, we're just going to keep booking it. No! Isra! Isra, why? No! Okay, quickly, quickly clean her wounds or lick her wounds. And then we'll, we'll scoot over this way. And then how is our male doing? He is getting a little older. So possibly we didn't want to breed these guys because they had a similar immunity, but I want to try And did that fail? That failed. We're gonna try breeding. There we go. We got uh, Cora at least is going to have a child And we're gonna travel and this should be the mountains. I'm pretty sure it looked like snow <laughs> um, It looked like snow. So we are probably going to die. I want to say um, but we're at least gonna see what it looks like. I'm super duper curious and oh my Yes, indeed. This is th This is so new. Oh my goodness. Okay. Do we have any food? We've got food nearby. Yes All right, we've got enough food to be able to not eat this time Here we go Let's Start new day. Do we smell anything or hear anything? Nope. So there, apparently there's new predators and new prey. So let's see. I'm going to have Kyotaku. Actually, I'm going to bring Isra up and we'll try breeding them. Oh, come on, Isra. Isra, why? Is that... Is she actually... No, she should have the ability... All right, I'm actually gonna bring. Okay. Oh, we can put uh, we can put Cora in this nest here, and then we can actually gather. And then I'm gonna bring Isme up this way. We do we have two e No, Isme and Isra. Okay, I'm gonna actually gather this. I want to start moving up here. Do we hear anything? No, not anything out of the ordinary. I want to move into the mountains. How are these guys on cold resistance, by the way? Uh, I don't know if they have any, so we might have to wait and try and mutate in some genetics down here at the base of the mountains. Do we hear anything? Nope. Smell anything? Nope. All right, so we had Nurota who got the... Oh, nimble fingers and the claw. Okay, good. Uh, poor eyesight, unfortunately. We do have that. Yeah, we have that to mutate. And, um... I'm gonna clear this and this, and I'm actually gonna put Cora up here, and we'll try. Yep, and then Cora will be able to collect from that nest. Let's gather this. It looks like it's a drought as well. And then Ezra, please come on. Yes, now we can make a nest for her here. All right, and we are running low on nesting material, which is not a good thing. So we're gonna start a new day. Um, let me. I'll clear all these. Ooh, okay. I may have to clear all these notifications, and one of them. Mutated in a gene. What did you get? You got the normal eyes. Good, 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 good. All right. This is going to be where we end up probably breeding quite a bit. And do we have anything? I don't see anything out of the ordinary still. We got to find new uh, bushes though. All right. I'm actually going to bring him here and we're going to actually gather some of this food with Cora. And I think it's a drought, unfortunately, which is not a good thing. And let's bring, okay, so I'm gonna bring Kirtaku. We want to breed him again and make sure, okay, and then Ezer, do we have anything else? I'm gonna have you, I'm gonna have you stay near the baby, but we need to decide which ones we're gonna be okay with taking damage. Um, Honestly, Duke Nunu is not a very healthy baby. He does have the normal eyes, but he has hemophilia. He has bad fertility. He does have big body secondary, but he got the claw again, and he's not a very good uh, child. What we want to try, what we're trying to breed in uh, from Ezra is the immunity, and I don't even think, oh, he did get that technically, but um, I don't know. I think the cons that way the pros. Also, Rara got short-sighted eyes, which is not good. So if we put them on Omega, they should be the ones to take damage. Although we're having two new babies born as well. What about Neurota? Neurota, uh, I'm going to have him, let him take damage as well. And then Yzma can take damage because she's not one of our breeding creatures. So we're kind of in, in a spot here. 
Oh my gosh! We had twins! <gasps> Cora! Oh my goodness, they're lovely! <gasps> oh! Oh, they're so pretty! And uh, let's move... Rara, I'm gonna move. And then Cora, my goodness! Oh my goodness, that's so pretty! <laughs> oh, that's so cool! And okay, wow! And then Nerota... Okay, let's see. Is there anything else that we can... What is that? Huh, I'm wondering what this is. This thing, it looks like some sort of plant. It's green, so that means it's a good thing. And then there is a mole that is not looking, so we could jump up behind it and snag it. There we go. Is there anything else we can use for food? I'm gonna actually send... Oh, Kirtaku! We're gonna lose Kirtaku! Oh, So Korra actually can't have... isn't gonna have any more babies. We're gonna have to make do with what we have. There is another berry bush up here, though. So, quickly, let's uh, clear away... Oops, I didn't want to destroy it, dang it! But that gave us enough food, at least. Although I'm gonna put um, Kirtaku on Omega, because he's gonna die. And we're gonna start moving Nerota this way. What is this thing? I don't know what this is! I want to know what this, a lot of these things are, honestly. Okay, we're going to have to figure, we're going to have a lot of figuring out to do. I'll probably release a second episode of Niche today, too. And uh, you can sit right here. And do we smell anything or hear anything? Bunnies, there's a leech down there. Um, we're going to actually collect these. I'm not going to have Cora banish anyone, but we do need to probably get another male. Cora may be done breeding. And I'm going to destroy this nest so we get the material back. So let's see. we got to figure out our next breeding pairs. Do we get any that had the good immunity? So do you can Nunu has it, but he has hemophilia and poor fertility. Rogue here. So none of these guys would have it. We do ha still have Isra, who could potentially pass it on still if we... Hmm, if we had a good male. Neurota... Nerota, I'm going to put him on Alpha, and we're actually going to breed him. And, oh, here's a nest, too. We're actually going to breed him and Yzra, I think, once he's old enough. And we'll clear away some of this. Yzma is going to pass away. Oh. And then, oh, gosh, we don't have enough food. She's already on Omega. Duke Nunu is on Omega, because I don't like... He, he's got poor genetics, generally. Rara's on Omega as well. We should be okay. Uh, do we smell any more food? There's another berry bush down here, so I think I might start... Um, I'm gonna leave the... Tw well, I'm, I'm gonna move Sereko up here, and then Roke here will stay. And I'm actually gonna move Duke Nunu and Rara this way, because they can start... And is she suffering i don't think she's suffering adverse effects from the cold so that's good but then we can start making our way towards another berry bush down here and hopefully that will provide us with some good food and i don't know what this is i'm very curious now we lost another that's a oh my goodness there's a bird and what is this it's a hot spring i bet oh I bet it's a hot spring, so if they get cold, they can warm up. Oh, you guys, that's cool. Okay, so Sireko, um, do we have a good mate for her? Uh, I'm going to move him here. And these guys, I don't think, can be taken as long as they stay together. Um, and we're gonna let Rara do the gathering. And there's another nest! Oh, this is a perfect natural nesting place! Oh, awesome! I didn't want to put her in the river. Why? Why? And I don't hear anything. What is this thing? It's like some sort of rock or something. And I don't think there's grass on the mountain either, necessarily. So, we're not gonna have enough food this turn either. Great. Um, who is gonna take damage? So, I'm gonna leave. I want Cora on Alpha. Roke here is not the greatest, so I'm gonna put him on Omega. His sister is pretty good, though. She's got good genetics. I want her on Alpha. And I want you on Alpha. 
and you are on alpha. Okay, that should do it. Some of them are going to take damage. Sorry, you guys. But um, we will gather from here now as well. I'm going to get you out of the water. I wonder if going the water would make them more cold. I don't think it does. And it seems like we're in the middle of a drought as well. Yes, one of our animals has died. Okay, do we smell anything useful? Or there is... There's this thing. I don't know what that is. I want to get up there. What is this? A twig bush. Oh, it gives you nesting material. <gasps> okay. And then there's... Is the mole actually out? I think the mole is out. Could we reach it? Maybe. Could we... If we get up here? Yes, we can. We're not going to have it this turn. So someone... some Oh, some of our creatures are going to have to take damage. Okay. Sereko... I don't want you taking damage. I don't want you taking damage. I don't want you taking damage. I'm sorry, Cora. You're gonna have to take damage this turn. Oh man, so food troubles are a theme with pretty much all of our creatures, it seems. All of our creatures ever. We're actually going to, though, gather from this bush and then we can come down here and then I'm gonna put Ezra in the nest and we did breed them. Okay, good. And uh, now we should have enough food this time. And then is there anything more we can do? Can we continue gathering from this? We can for now. And let's see. I'm actually going to have Sireko venture further into the mountains. So apparently there are new predators, but I don't see them. And it's nice because we don't actually have to clear the grass. So we're going to keep have these two keep venturing into the mountains here. And I think we're going to wrap up the episode here for now, but I'll probably release a double episode today because it's a new update and because that's so exciting. So I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay over and out.